Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's been a while and today I thought I would come back and talk about some skincare products that I'm using right now and that I adore and love. So my program on my computer uh, that I usually use I have some issues with it so I'm trying out a new one so I'm sorry if the editing isn't as good as it used to be. I'm a bit uncomfortable right now because I wear red lipstick. It's like the first time and I don't know. I don't like it. Do you? Tell me in the comments. Well, let's talk about the products. So I've I spent a lot, a lot, a lot of money on skincare products. It's difficult to find something that you actually like. Finally, I'm here and I've found something that I like. So I have a combination skin. It's oily but dry from um, moisture. I'm not a skincare educated skincare person. So <laughs> it's not my specialty, but I've been to skincare experts and they told me like buy this product and yeah, it's always a flop. When I have periods where my skin is okay, but a little bit dry and well, I have big pores and some um, sits, I use these two. This is a brand from a um, pharmacy in Sweden. I, I think it's Swedish. Is it? Is it though? I don't know. Okay, I have to check this up. But it says like pharmacy, blah, blah, blah since 1939 on the package, packaging. Aku Nordic, so it's Nordic, but I don't know if it's actually Swedish. I guess you can find these somewhere on the internet if you're um, living in another country, so I really, really, really recommend them. So first we have the blemish treatment. I just take a, a pad and some of the product. And then clean my skin and I turn it to the other side clean and sometimes I take another and you can see like ah, a lot of disgusting things on the pad after so it feels really really nice and well it's a daily face toner cleanses pores prevents breakouts exfoliating effect no perfume and I actually think it it's actually doing that it works I don't get these huge breakouts while using these. It's it's usually when I'm out and I don't have the energy to go and get another one. That's usually when I get these huge breakouts. So it works. And the same brand, Mattifying Moisturizer. Daily face cream calms and moisturizes, soft and smoothness, helps fight clot pores. It works exactly like that. It's not heavy on the skin and yeah, I just I just like it. In the winter, it doesn't really get me as much moist, moisturized as I actually need. So I will have to find another moisturizer to use during the cold part of the year. And I live in Sweden, so we have a lot of cold, a lot of snow, and a lot of rain and darkness. So, when I have my better days, I use these. Now, I was so tired of getting these huge sits everywhere, and they're like, they never want to leave, and you get like really, really annoyed. And now when I'm, I'm getting older, I'm 29 years old, and my skin isn't as nice, <laughs> as it used to be and I can't put as much makeup on because it looks very creasy and it sits in the in the, my fine lines and everything. It didn't really do that a couple of years ago so I'm getting older. My my sits has become a bigger issue for me than it used to be. I was so fucking tired of this and I went uh, online and searched and searched and I found a product that, well, people said it would 
like do wonders for you and I was a bit skeptic but I ordered it it wasn't really that expensive and these aren't expensive either they're like really really affordable and these are the products a daily moisturizer um, it has SPF 30 a lightweight lotion for breakout prone skin it helps to control shine and dryness during acne care routine skin is hydrated for 24 hours with alantoin and UVA protection 50 milliliters from Bassi Derm dermatologically tested oil control and this is amazing amazing so when I have these huge breakouts I use these two uh, and combine them and it works what my daughter comes down here looking for me hiding out in the basement let's in so these two uh, the moisturizer it's amazing I use it in the morning and in the evening after I've applied this little bastard I think they have this is 10% uh, with the active ingredients but I think they have had one that's a bit softer a bit more nicer <laughs> to the skin because when you apply this you can feel it you can feel the pain and you you know it works so it's a better than 80 10 percent gel and the active ingredient is benzo benzo ul peroxide 40 grams and uh, yeah. You don't use these everywhere, you just take a little little dot on your finger and put it right on the uh, sits or I also apply it here where I have some um, huge pores and on the nose and just where you actually need it, not everywhere. It will last you a long long time I apply it in the morning and evening as well and then I apply this after maybe five ten minutes these are the best skincare products I ever used ever 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 if you have acne you should definitely definitely try these out okay I don't know if this is a Swedish brand or if <sighs> does it say France International Galderma International. Maybe I've been living under a rock and just yeah, I've never seen these. Um, I do recognize the brand. I don't know why, but yeah. Disclaimer: This is not sponsored. That's my tip and tricks for today. I hope these will work for you because they're very very affordable so you don't have to spend these huge amounts of money on just shit products that actually don't work, okay? But if you have a tip for me for a heavier moisturizing cream during the winter year that doesn't make you break out, please let me know in the comment box. Uh, it's so difficult to record with my daughter at home. But I really, really want to come back and record. So now I'm learning this iMovie, I think, on my MacBook. And I hope I will get the hang of it. But I think it's a bit tricky. Uh, previously, I've used Adobe Premiere Pro. And I loved it. But now it's so expensive that I don't think it's worth it. So, uh, yeah. And it just doesn't want to work on my computer. So... I think I have to uh, reinstall it and create a new account or something, but nah. I'm going to try to learn iMovie instead, but if you have any tips on that as well, just let me know on any program that you think is amazing. Are you still here on YouTube? Do you watch videos daily and what kind of content? Do you wish me creating? Do you still like um, me testing out new products like Shein, a full face of Shein products or a new eyeshadow palettes? And 
what do you wish for now, a couple of years later? Please, tell me, so I can try to make it work. I see on my screen that it looks like a lines. Is that just on my screen or is it actually on the footage? Okay, I'll have to check it out later. I'm sorry if it is, because sometimes with the um, settings on the camera, it doesn't like my settings sometimes, um, so I have to change them. Well, that's everything for today. Maybe I will record something new tomorrow. I don't know what, though. Maybe a full face of something. And I'm very, very active on Instagram, so if you haven't checked out my Instagram, you should do that and also please comment like follow subscribe yeah just everything okay have a very nice day and i see you in a couple of days bye